Isabel, nice to meet you. So glad to have you with us today. Nice to meet you as well. We're really excited to hear all about Viasana, all about yourself as a real estate manager at Viasana, uh, and of course, how you found Ryan useful in your organization. So basically, uh, Viasana is a French startup who started in 2020. So our goal is to help uh, doctors and health practitioners to found a location to practice. So I'm in the real estate part, so um, my, my role is to find some new accommodation for those people. And obviously, I'm using a rayon for kind of creating the, 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 the plan and to see if there is enough spaces for those practitioners and yeah, to arrange the, the properties. So you're actually offering offices, turnkey offices for rent. Is it um, on an hourly basis, on a monthly basis? What's your business model? Uh, we are very flexible. The minimum is just one day, but it could be two days, a week, a month, or even a year. It depends about the, the practitioner, about his needs. Obviously, because we are speaking to different type of health a practitioner, we need a different type of spaces, different type of yeah, accommodations and furnitures. So it's really um, an interesting process of segmenting your your users right the type of doctors you have the type of equipment you need and then finding a space that can accommodate their needs uh, because people also like to meet different type of practitioner between themselves uh, we create those flexible infrastructures where, where there is both doctors and psychologic but there is sometimes specific needs and it depends about the location we are we have a good relationship with brokers who can send us a lot of properties for sales or rents. Uh, we are doing both. And it's always uh, commercial uh, properties. So let's talk about the process of what you were mentioning. A broker would send a floor plan your way. Um, typically, I would assume a PDF yeah. or a different format. And then if you can tell us a little bit about how you would work um, with those floor plans. Yeah. So my team, um, we are five in our real estate team. So all of my colleagues are using Rayon. This is the only, for now, the only software that we use for making the plan because we, it's easier for us to just like to understand the, the, the software and it's quite really easy to use, uh, which is great for us because we don't, ha we don't have any skills in architecture. So we, we know our job, but we, we don't have any background in that. So it's quite really easy to, for us to access. So obviously we receive uh, all plans, uh, either by PDF, by pictures, sometimes it's just uh, a draw by hand, so it's more complicated. Mm -hmm. so, yeah, so we import the picture, or if it's a picture, we just copy and, and paste. And yeah, we start the plan from scratch. Uh, we are really using the basic tools of uh, Rayon. So I think my colleague and I are a lot using polyline, line, circle, rectangle. It's the basic, but it's the most, I think, most practical for us. And also the, the tool called scale, uh, because obviously we need to know uh, the space of each uh, desk or each spaces, all the, the tools considering distance and area. Sometimes we use a bit of furniture just for showing to the design department where would will be the, the restroom, the space the kitchen there is always a kitchen in our centers we are using also rayon for showing where the the water goes mm -hmm. or the electricity sometimes mm -hmm. so what you do is ryan is the preliminary feasibility study to see that you have enough square meters in the floor plan then you sometimes do uh furniture layouts and also piping and electricity exactly that's it i think it's we are spending more time to see if the feasibility is working. We just spend the time of how can we scale the, the project and how can we organize the, the property. Sure. And I understand that you have um, standard kind of equipment that you need. So uh, physician bed, uh, if you were saying physiotherapy, so probably gym equipment. Do you use those furniture blocks in Ryan or do you just draw something that symbols them um, do you have a, a custom library block that you made or no? No, we didn't create 
uh, those kind of stuff sometimes because we know the globally the space that we need for those kind of gym uh, spaces mm -hmm. so if the the space is enough large or and we just put the the name of like gym and that's it Okay. Uh, because it's really a beginning for us to work with those kind of practitioners. Mm -hmm. So it's now it's just making the test. Obviously, when I will create the, the plan from scratch at the beginning, I will know if whether or not it can be a, like a psychological center or another type of center, depending on the space of how it looks. But yeah, considering all the furniture, it will depend. It will really depend on the sales department who will sell the space and let me, let us know how can we arrange the, the space. And the sales, how do they show the location to the clients? Do they show a floor plan or do they just describe it? They will show uh, the plan and they will describe it. And most of the time they will start to sell the property when all the construction part will be done. And the, um, and the floor plan that the sale do show the practitioners, is that a floor plan that's made in Ryan or is that a floor plan that's made in a different software? Uh, on Ryan, I think it's the, it, uh, it's the same that I will create for them and they will print it and just showing how the organization of the, the, the space will be in the future or in a few months. Cool. Thank you so much for your time explaining how you work at Nvidia Sun. I think, first of all, your idea and you know business model as a startup is so interesting. Um, and secondly, I'm really happy that you find Ryan useful for your work. Thank you very much for your time as well, and thank you for listening.